diamonds. I like stunning. I like shining. I like million dollar deals. Okay, all right, all right. Cut the shenanigans. Hey, y'all. It's your girl. <laughs> Brit. So, I am here today because I told you guys that I was going to show you how I do my guacamole. So, in the process of me doing my guacamole, I'm going to do a bacon egg guacamole sandwich. It's going to be my first time making that in my life. I'm pretty sure it'll turn out good. So, because I like guacamole, eggs, and bacon. So, I'm also going to redo that challenge that I was showing y'all with the, the little egg trick or whatever. Because my son wants boiled eggs. I want scrambled eggs. So, I got eggs on deck. And, what else? I think I'm going to do some more Rasta pasta today. Because remember the other day, I only did like a little batch. I was practicing them because they didn't have everything that I wanted. Or shall I say, they didn't have the heavy whip that I wanted. So I used all this damn Parmesan cheese and made the shit all like cheesy, too cheesy. So I'm going to redo it. I know what to do now. Not so much Parmesan cheese. And, you know, I'm going to get in touch with my Spanish style, you know, while I make my guacamole. I should play some music in the background, but I don't know if they're going to let me. They're going to probably hate on my video and tell me that I don't own the rights to this music. Maybe I'll try something. I don't know. I don't know. But uh, let me show you this. This is the best bacon ever. I got the fire. Got the fire. Holla at your body if you want that Oscar Mayer. Y'all know nothing about that song right there. Oscar Mayer bacon. Best bacon. I usually do maple number one sometimes it's hard to find maple and number two that is expensive like they can be like nine dollars i'm like i can go buy a pig and kill it my damn self like there was a maple syrup on that thing anyway <clears throat> i need to get these dishes out there and wash these dishes put these dishes up clean this get this out of the way and I need to work on my posture because I have a like ever since I was young, you know, just so I was like a tomboy, you know what I'm saying? I was like, <laughs> you know, shit. But let me be a lady and I'll be back. <laughs> See, I was on my tippy toes and <laughs> trying to work my posture, so I stand up straight <laughs> and then. back y'all all right so another thing that i'm going to do today we're going to detox mm -hmm, yeah that's right i'm going to go boo boo i have nothing else to do today i'm going to be in the house i am going to be eating so i'm going to detox this is the aeso tea i'm sorry i looked at the wrong way this is the aeso tea you put it in your water bottle of water you drink it you do it 30 minutes before you eat where are my other scissors yes these are the scissors that i want you do this that's good enough as long as you can get it open and pick your bottle of water Drink a little from off the top. And then you pour it in. Yes. Look at that. You see her falls to the bottom. Ooh. And it sits at the top. Yeah. So we're going to shake this up. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake these. 
sorry, I think I got to mix with something, I don't know. It's like whenever I hear certain words, it just makes me think of certain things, songs, you know, and then it just comes out. But you shake this up, real good. Don't need to add anything. You just need the water, you just need the tea. That's it, agua. How do you say tea in Spanish? Tea. drink it i like my water to be room temperature cold water mm, i don't like that in the summertime when it's already hot outside and i need something refreshing cold water but other than that i like room temperature water muy delicioso it tastes just like tea like a green tea check these eggs. Green tea with no sugar. Let that boil a little bit longer. I got my bacon in the oven because what's going on back there? I got my bacon in the oven because I'd be damned if I'm fried. I do not fry bacon. That's one fight that I will not win. I've been in trouble. Bacon, you know, get the popping, and I'm like, you wanna, you wanna pop off? You popping off on me? Next thing you know, it's a fight in here with bacon grease and Brittany. So, I put bacon in the oven, and I let it do all the popping it wants to do in the oven because I ain't got time. Pick and choose your battles. Ain't that right, Taylor? Well, you got two minutes of love bacon, huh? What's that? This is my ISO detox tea. Something you don't need. Let me, mm. hmm? Let me try. You can get a little swig. I'll drown you. Come here. Wait, what does it taste like? Taste it. Hold your head back. Hold your head back. Open your mouth. Oh, open your mouth. It don't taste like anything. I know. It has, it's like it's like a hint of green tea. No sugar or anything. Water. And you know what it does? What? It's a detox. You know what detoxing is? Not really. <laughs> Makes me sleepy, doesn't it? No, I wish. <laughs> Take another guess. Makes you energized? You definitely don't need no energy. Take one more guess. If you don't get it, I'll tell you. It's something we do normally, like every day anyway. What do you do just about every day? I play games. This thing got nothing to do with playing games. Oh, oh, I something just, with your body makes me strong. No, what do you do every day? Sleep. Yeah. Okay. When you go to the bathroom, what do you do? I pee. Oh, it makes me boo boo more. There you go. It's a cleanser. It's a detox. Get all those toxins out. And it happens so smoothly. Oh, I love it. <laughs> you need to log back in now. It's 1230. We'll be back, y'all. <laughs> and we're back. <sighs> so what I'm going to do first is try this trick again with the eggs, right? Stay right there. Don't run away. Okay, I think that the egg has to be like fresh, like just boiled. So the lady who did it, she just went like this. She went to the bottom. Okay, she peeled off the top. I guess I'll put this in the bowl. Okay. <laughs> that is gonna be funny. If I struggle again, I'm gonna be so pissed. <laughs> Look, it came out. I did it. I went back and 
I watched it. I did it. You wanna you wanna watch me do it? You wanna watch me? You wanna mm. watch me do the trick? Sure. Okay. Alright. So fresh full day. Right out the pan. Oh, for me it works again. I know. This is so exciting. Okay, you hit the top. You hit the bottom. Okay, you think that's enough, that's enough, that's enough. Whose trick is this? And then uh, she YouTube's? peeled off the, the top. No, I saw it on TikTok, actually. Yeah, and who who originally created it? Um, It was a Caucasian lady. Yeah, exactly, so you didn't create it. Created. Anyway. So you can't call it yours. I didn't say it was mine. I just said, whose trick is this anyway? Ooh, that's what you get for trying to be smart. Mm. Anyway, so I took a little bit off the top. I cracked the bottom. Let me try. It was. It would do this with you here. Let me try. Hold on, no, it's gonna work this time. No, I wanna try. Let me try. Hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me, let me bring it down. Yeah, there you go. Just, so just do like this? Yeah, just blow into it. Oh, well, 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 why, why you up here talking so, mm, you still got the bottom on you. Oh well, you shouldn't. You should have cracked it more. No, no. See, I didn't. It was no. Look, y'all. He just. He just doesn't want to admit the fact that the bottom is still on there. Well, I know the bottom is there, but at least I still did it. You you did do it, but you ever told some. Try to show me up, mate. No, I did it right the first time. And when I play the footage back and you see it, you're gonna be like, oh, that's how you doing it, okay? Yeah, straight like that. So, you suck anyway. Bye. Go to school. <laughs> Go to your room. <laughs> Go to school. Okay, so these eggs are his. You'll never guess where I got this from, and I'm not telling you. <laughs> it was a restaurant. <laughs> I left a good tip. I deserved it. <sighs> anyway, so that was that. Now we have to move on to my guacamole. Guacamole, mole, 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 mole. I'll be back. <laughs> All right, y'all. So I got um, our son's bold egg here. Seasoned with pepper, garlic, obey. We like eggs. And then he wants two pieces of bacon. So my bacon is done. I'm gonna set this at the table for him. And then he can come and get it. And they have another break, which will be very soon. Today's a short day in school. Look at that. It look nice and seasoned. Oh, love eggs. All right. Mm, be back. Okay. Now for the guacamole. It's gonna be avocado, right? And it's fairly soft. So it should be good. I hate sometimes when I open up an avocado, and it's so like brown I guess it's like too bright I don't know but let's hope this one's good I'm still eating it <laughs> anyway I need a bowl Take this out. Yeah, baby. Mm -hmm. Let me bring it down. Okay. Don't mind me. 
the shells are innocent. Spun the eggs. This is the complicated part. Like, what is the perfect way to get the seed out? Anyway. Okay, done with that. First things first. I'm gonna get my line. Gonna get my line. So, definitely need to squeeze some lime up in this and make it flip. Done with that. Lime. Put the lime in the coconut and mix it all up. Hey, y'all know that song. Wasn't that Tiger's first song? Love, I love that guy. I'm gonna squeeze this in here. Get that lime juice going up in here. Now, of course, they have like lime that's in that little container thing, thing, lime thing at the grocery store, but <laughs> you know me, I'm cheap, so it's cheaper to just. Buy a line. Now this dark color is going to be gone soon. And when you make guacamole, sometimes it's best to um use the avocado when it's kind of like dark like that. Because when the avocado is like fresh, fresh, it's kind of hard to like mush it up. Mushy. You want to break already? No. What you doing out here? Sir. Oh my god, you're trying to use chopsticks to eat your boiled eggs. Okay. <clears throat> Next. Go back to class, sir. But you missed something. And this is math. You got to do some some extra credit or something like that today. You don't know what I'm talking about? Ask him. I do. I do. Tomato. Do I need more tomato? I only got one avocado. I might as well use some more tomato. Love tomato. Tomato and onion is so good, baby. Mm -hmm. Okay. We want to chop this up. I need to give me one of them little uh, chopper things. I think it's called a chopper. So you can chop up stuff like this. If you need help, let me know. Okay. I didn't like math growing up, but now that I'm an adult, I like math. And I have to deal with math when I'm at work. So it makes me like math. Okay. I think this is chopped up all right. You know, I'm using my, my Mimi knife set. Yeah, this is good. Good thing about having long nails. I can use it to help you. I ain't gonna cut my finger. I'm gonna cut my nail. And that's fine. Open that bit. Mix this in there. Now, my onions, when I do my guacamole, I like red onions. I like red onions, period. I'll take that any day over a regular white onion. Looks good already. 
Oke. Okay. Kamar angin. I love onions. I'm so excited about this sandwich. Put that to the side. Taylor said he don't want no avocado or anything. He just wanted a boiled egg and some bacon. And I'm like, bro, you missing out, bro. Some of this tea. Hold on. Ooh, why my body look like that? <laughs> Mom built like that. This is a bad angle. Mm. Mm. My son always be saying that. He be like, Ugh, why you look like that? Why she built like that? And it's so funny to me because of how he says it. <laughs> he played too much. Oof. Next month, I'm starting my um 30-day challenge. I believe I told y'all that earlier, and I'm so excited about that. I'm trying to get rid of this back fat, my tummy fat, because Thanksgiving came around. Now Christmas about to roll around, so I'm glad the challenge is starting next month and not this month because we still got Christmas. And I'm going to eat again for Christmas. So, red onions, tomatoes. This is a lot. And it's just me eating it. Hopefully Taylor will do some later with me. I'm the human blender. Look at me go. Imagine how quick I can pop my son in the back of his head with these fast hands. There we go. All right. Okay. This this might be okay. All right. Um. Now. <clears throat> back up a little bit. So. Do some pepper. And do some garlic. Cause you know I put garlic on everything. Cause my boy. Get a little bit of salt. Wanna chop it up and make guacamole? <clears throat> mm. Wow, you know what it tastes that time. Mm. Still need more of something. I'm gonna do some more pepper. I'm gonna do some more salt. And of course, I'm gonna do some more garlic. What's new in my life? Stir this up. It's gonna taste good with the bacon and the egg. Oh my God. Oh my God. Honey. Honey, oh my God. Mm-hmm. Mm. I -hmm. mm. really taste all the lime right there. Yes.
my garlic. <laughs> and don't judge me. I know y'all probably like, oh my God, why she putting all that? Listen, I have not received one complaint from my guacamole. People love it. Mm -hmm. I can just like eat it off the bowl. some onion and tomato mm-hmm okay now my bacon is done <laughs> my bacon is done baking I got my toast already over here mm-hmm I also use the oven for my toast I don't have a toaster which is okay mm. I purposely didn't buy one Whereas it's been, I just feel like that'll make me eat bread, more bread that I'm not supposed to be eating. So, let me get these eggs started. I'll be back. So, I chose to fry my egg instead of scramble. I think it'll be easier for my sandwich. Um, yeah, I'm not going to season it too much because I already have enough seasoning in the guacamole. There's salt and stuff in the bacon. So it's like, I'm gonna make this real light. I ain't gonna season it too much. So can y'all guess what I'm gonna throw up on these eggs? Sorry, I was looking right there. It's supposed to be right here. I know. But you guessed right. Garlic. If a vampire ever come near me, let me tell you. Hmm. My breath alone will probably kill him with the garlic. Woo! A little bit of garlic. I'm gonna do a little bit of pepper, just a little bit. Yeah, baby. Mm -hmm. Now, how am I gonna turn this thing? That's gonna be my issue. I hate when I'm frying an egg like this and I try to turn it and that joint just gets so messed up. Yeah. It's like I can turn it, but I can't flip it. If y'all have any future suggestions for the girl, let me know. I guess I take it like this. Eee, okay, okay. I had to step back. Didn't want the butter to pop me. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. My yolk getting stuck to the pan. No, it's not. It just needs to be a little bit harder. That wasn't a bad flip. It wasn't a bad flip. Look at this. Wasn't a bad flip. Now, if this shit start popping, y'all see me run? Don't you. Shit. Okay. All right. Now my my bread, my toast. I kept it in the oven for too long. <laughs> but it's all good. So please don't judge me, and I won't judge you. I really made this joint too hard. It's joint crispy as hell. I took the crust off of it because I don't like crust. And I kept it in for so long, the crust came back. Ain't that a bitch? Mmm. I'm almost done. Damn. Ah! Don't 
do me like that, baby. Don't do me like that. You're just an egg. Probably because I put too much butter in the joint. Another thing, butter. I love butter. I love bread, butter. But I don't like soggy bread. You know how you can make a sandwich and depending on what you put on the sandwich, it makes the bread soggy. Oh my God, it makes me want to throw up. Part of the reason why I didn't do another thing of toast because I'm like, well, it'll be hard. It's not going to get mushy with the guacamole and stuff. So that's cool. It'll suffice. Yeah, this is good. Okay. Mm. Mm. Baby got gay. All right. Um, so I'm trying to think. I'm going to put my bacon on first. I'll probably put my guacamole on first. I'm gonna put my egg on one of them so I can get it out this pan and it'll warm up the toast. All right, uh, keep still. Why are y'all moving? Okay, come with me. Come to me, I can be what you need, oh baby. Do it, 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 do it. Relax your mind, let your country free. Now roll with the sounds of the BBE. Do it, 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 do it. Taking my nutri bears. Need to order some more. You at the corner of my eye. Wanna get I, I want you to come be with me. You're the only one I wanna talk to, but I don't wanna rush. I, I'm here. When will you make your move? Okay. I think I got ADHD or something. Okay. I'm gonna put this on here, my guacamole. I'm gonna put too much. I'm excited about these. Y'all ever had um apple butter? Oh my god. I usually do bacon, egg, apple butter sandwich. Listen. Y'all hear how hot my toast is? <laughs> Don't judge me. Okay. My first time, I'm excited. <laughs> wow. That's tight. I'm actually glad that the toast is hard the way it is because the guacamole would have probably made it mushy and then I would have like <clears throat> This is good. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm being healthy today. If y'all make any sandwiches with guacamole, comment and let me know so I can try it. Mm. 
I got a lot of guacamole. Mm. Mm. And my sister was here right now. She was like, stop at that damn smack him. But like, but it's good. You know, sometimes when I put more guacamole on here. Sometimes when something's so good, it's like you have to smack. You have to get all the ingredients on your tongue. Like just let it swirl around like have a party in your mouth. Like it's like you can't taste everything unless you smack. And sometimes, depending on what I'm eating, I me mean, personally, I have to smack or else my teeth won't hurt. <laughs> but then it's like, oh, it's just because your bite, your bite is off. And I'm like, you sure, bruh? Because it'd be hurting when I eat certain things. I might have to get a second pain on cuz, cuz, mmm. I try to believe him because he's Asian and Asians are smart. So I'll be like, all right, maybe you're right. But in the back of my head, I'm like, maybe you're wrong. Because it hurt. I don't care about no bite. Because I got overbite. Yeah, overbite. And I have like a mouth guard that I use at night for my overbite. He wanted, he wanted me to get Invisalign. But I told him, I said, Shorty, you're going to have to wait till I see what's going on with my taxes next year because they out here giving out stimulus checks and shit. They might try to make me pay it back or something. I don't know. So I got high hopes for you. We're going to see. <laughs> like shit. Mm. Battery going low. I'm really proud of myself with this. I really feel like I'm being healthy today. I can't wait for next month. Portion control. Make sure I eat the right stuff. I'm gonna get this stomach down. Work out this back. Mm. This pandemic this year made me gain 10 pounds. This time. As you listening, it all went to my face, my arms, my back, and my midsection. Oh shit. It went to my thighs and my hips too, but not like how I would want it to. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Anyway. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get off here. Now go about y'all day. Have a good day. Try the little egg challenge. Make sure it's fresh. Not boil too hard. Because I think that's where the issue lies. Mm. Mm. Any avocado recipes? Hit me up. I need that. Instead of me doing avocado toast, is there something else that I can put? Well, not avocado toast, guacamole. I don't do avocado toast, I do guacamole. Is there something else that I can like put my guacamole on that's healthy, that's like toast? Mm. 
or bread, but it's not. I don't know. But I'm trying to think of some healthier ways. I need to get away from bread, so. Mm. All right, y'all. I'm gonna probably like, all right, Brittany. It's just so good. So I'm gonna go. Okay. Y'all have a good day. And I'm gonna think about what I can cook next. Peace.